Welcome back. We're gonna continue on with some main missions, and I hope you guys enjoy. I didn't stick around to see what happened. I gotta get our bike. I believe we are doing a Sarah mission. Looking to buy, hope. Hey, how's life? A nice bear. Oh. St. John. This is Mark Copeland and Deacon St. John. Hey, Cope. What's up? Just checking in. A couple of my men were up to the top of Leary Mountain the other day. Said they found a safe house set up in an old Forest Service watchtower. Is that right? Yes, sir. That's what I'm told. They said it was abandoned, but funny thing. Whoever lived there left behind a body. Shape too about the sound of it. Really? <laughs> Sarah, come back to us. O'Brien, I'm at one of your beacons, the one near Camp Creek. Uh, there's nothing here. Hold on. Uh, okay. A field op should be there any minute. You know the drill. O'Brien out. Yeah, I know the drill. Try not to get my ass shot off while being your goddamn peeping Tom. <laughs> John out. Yep, and I suck at sneaking, so this should be fun. Yeah, so what was that all about? I mean, last time we talked, it sounded like you were pissing your hazmat suit. It's nothing. I told you there are people above me who don't want us to know what's going on. And I got too close. I was going to You know what? I don't give a shit. All I want from you is information on Sarah. Wait a minute. I got someone working on it. It's... It's going to take time. I guess you have to be patient. Yeah? Well, I don't think I got a lot of choice here, do I? This research group isn't part of my unit, so I can't track them after this op. I need you to... Place a tracker on their chopper. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Oh, and you want me to spy on the guy I wear in the white space suit? Yeah, anything else? Hey, yeah, try not to get your ass shot off. Hey, anyone yeah. else heard that? Calm was still open before. Don't think of it as, like, beating, beating Tom or, like, opposition <laughs> peeping Tom. It's, we're peeping Tom, don't worry. Clean, right? I mean, 
not clean, but most freaks are so caked with shit and piss. Oh, I saw a drifter. That's disgusting. Yeah, well, again. You didn't see nothing. Well, what it means is that some freaks get up in the morning, they shower, they get dressed, they put on their favorite gold watch, they kiss their wife goodbye, and then they head out the door for a fun day of eating us and <laughs> shitting themselves. Why the hell are these guys wasting their time with this shit? <sighs> Hope you got all that, O'Brien. Okay, now I just gotta get that a lot of here. Brian, are you there? Oh, Brian! <laughs> Hold on. Yeah, I'm here. I planted your tracking device and I got your data. The researcher, were they male or female? What? What? Why? Was it a man or a woman? Uh, it was a woman and no, I didn't catch her name. So it looks like there's some smart ones. Ooh, new skill point. What are we gonna do with it? I think we haven't done any survival yet. All right, we're gonna. Finally get some survival points. We gotta get that stamina. St. Really John, the best. this is Mark Copeland at Deacon St. John. Hey, Cope, what's up? Just checking in. Show A couple me. of my men were up to the top of All right, back to Ricky. Leary Mountain the other day said they found a safe house set up in an old Forest Service watchtower. Is that right? Yes, sir, that's what I'm told. They said it was abandoned, but funny thing. Whoever lived there left behind a bike. Good shape, too, by the sound of it. Really? Indeed. But that's not the funny thing. The funny thing is they went back up there today to pick it up, but... Bike was gone. Now ain't that a head scratcher? Look, Cope, this is all really fascinating, but uh. Now hold on, here's the fascinating part. They swear that old bike, well, it looked a lot like the one Boozer used to ride. Okay, so let me get this straight, Cope. You guys went up to O'Leary Mountain. You found what you thought was Boozer's bike. And the first thing you thought of was, hey, why don't we just go back and steal it? Salvage, D. Salvage. But no, that was my second thought. My first was, whatever happened to old Boozer? Manny says he hasn't seen him around for some time. I don't know, Cope. Next time I see him, I'll let him know how much you miss him. St. John out! Deke, I'm really worried. Uh, Ricky, what's up? The Butler twins, Abigail and Gabby. The you know them? No, but uh, I've seen them around. What's 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 going on? What's wrong? They went out fishing yesterday, and they didn't come back. No. Well, the lake sure is pretty safe so long as they stay out of the marsh. That's just it. They weren't at Lost Lake. They went east, over to the Metolius River. The hell were they thinking? Okay, all right, yeah, I'll uh, I'll see if I can find them. Deacon, thank you so much. No problemo. We're going fishing.
and jump out of the way. Nope, he's standing strong today. You there? Yeah, Addy, what's up? Can you stop by the infirmary when you get a chance? Anything wrong? No, I just wanted to talk to you. Uh, yeah, okay. What else can you tell me? Before everything went to hell, the girl's family had a fishing site that they always used to go to. I marked it on your map. Okay, I'll start there. Deacon out. Okay, the girls are fishing. Oh, shit. Marauders, Jesus. Up this way. Oh, Jesus. Well, I'm gonna take it as the shooting. Pistol snipe. Ah. Got him. He needs a sniper rifle. What do you got? Good old. I saw you over here. You poked your face. I only got four health. Why does that happen? I don't want that. Sorry, uh, we just have to get you back to camp. Come on, come on, with me. No, no, no. I can make it myself. I can. Okay, go, go. You just got kidnapped. But, all right, you can make it back yourself. You can make it back. Okay. I ain't gonna tell you you can't. need fuel so don't mind if I do <sighs> fuel can still absolutely love this game I think it was very underrated when it came out it's enough searching Oh, here we go. 
I see deer run. bear Deke, this is Tucker. Stop by. I've got work for you. Tuck, hey. Okay. I'll see if I can make time Deacon out. Oh, come on, bear. I know you want to. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. You bear, 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 bear. Afraid of the dark. Mm. How convenient. Ah, oh, they took him out. I didn't get to see it though. Hey, Deacon, you got a second? How's William? I haven't seen him lately. How's Boozer? How the hell are any of us? He's surviving. Yeah, well, then he's doing better than most. Yeah. Listen, you need to keep an eye on him. What do you mean? Well, losing an arm is a big adjustment. He's given up the life he had. <laughs> Wasn't much of a life, Addy. I You're his friend. The only one he's got. Surviving isn't living. All right, what's next? I gotta go talk to Boozer. And a good old fast travel. Let's not take the bike in. I'm gonna assume Boozer's not even gonna be here. Boozer's fine. He'll live anyway. Oh, well, he is here. Don't mind me. I know you guys are working hard, but I'm gonna just step in all of your work. Hey, hold on. Oh, what do we gotta do? How's the work going? What's it look like? <laughs> Later. <laughs> How's the work? What does it look like? Bye. Huh. <laughs> Alrighty, well, it's going to wrap it up for this one. I know we just had a very eventful talk with Boozer and his uh, life here. Uh, if you guys made it through this far, thank you. Have a good one.